AT&T has teased us with the world's first mobile 5G device. Hi, I'm Chris with the Mobile Internet Resource Center here with some interesting news on the race to 5G coming from AT&T. Now this past Friday, AT&T announced that the night before they had engaged in the world's first millimeter wave mobile 5G browsing session. What does that mean? Well, it means that somebody surfed the web on a genuine mobile 5G device. The first time this has ever happened, and it's actually a commercial device that will be shipping soon. And AT&T teased a little bit about this. The Netgear Nighthawk 5G. So this is gonna be the big brother, it seems from the pictures to be the literal big brother of the existing Nighthawk 4G, the old version of the Nighthawk. Um, but the, it'll be the world's first 5G hotspot and very likely the world's first 5G mobile device. Now, you might have remembered a month ago, Verizon announced that they were the first to 5G when they announced that beginning October 1st, they were going to be deploying residential 5G uh, in four select cities. So that what Verizon was doing is pre-standardized residential non-mobile 5G deployments, and all of those deployments are going to have to be upgraded next year to the standardized 5G, and those are non-mobile technologies. They have to be professionally installed in a fixed place. AT&T is promising that in the next few weeks, they will be revealing the plans and the details to roll out mobile 5G using this Nighthawk 5G hotspot in 12 cities in the US parts of 12 cities, which is a very important thing to keep in mind, and then uh, an additional seven cities in early next year. So still, very, very tiny initial deployment. It will probably be only one device that makes it out on the market by the end of 2018, but it will be the Nighthawk 5G. Um, now, we're still waiting for a lot of the details. AT&T has only barely teased with just a picture and a report that somebody surfed the web in Waco, Texas. But it means they're getting close. They actually have production hardware that they're testing, and they've promised that real details will be coming in a matter of weeks. So keep your eye out on this as the next step in the race to 5G world.